And we're going to City Hall. <laughs> and we're almost there. Uh, is it recording? Is it recording? Yeah, I'm excited to meet the mayor. Yeah, me too. Yeah. You guys are going to interview the mayor. How do you feel? I feel so awesome. I feel so awesome. Now we're going. Say that again, say that again. Making an episode of, um, I can, it's a the Regal show, the Regal show. I'm gonna say, um, hi, I'm Regal, and this is my uh, filmmaking crew. Uh, we're from Hunt. This is an after school program. Can we get an interview with you? Let's go in and see if he's ready. Hello, I'm doing great. How about you? Well, I'm glad you're here. You're you're here in the mayor's office. Uh, we've got uh, we're on the third floor of City Hall, and um, I, I, I don't know about you, but I I love this building. I think it's a great classic New England City Hall, and um, and I love coming to work here every day. Um, what time do you come out of work? Uh, what time do I come? You know, it depends on the day. Uh, I often am in around, uh, you know how my day often works is I often am starting to work from home early in the morning. So I'm usually working before on emails or whatnot, before seven, uh, before, before, uh, before we have, for an hour or two, before we have breakfast at 7.30 in the morning and we have a half hour together from 7.30 to 8 and then I'm usually on the phone as soon as they're out the door, and oftentimes I'm um, making phone calls and they get to the office around nine, and then some days I get to leave around 5.30 or quarter to six, and get home for dinner around six o'clock, but a lot of days, the way local government works, we had evening meetings here in City Hall. Like last night, I was here in City Hall until about 11.30 at night because we had a city council meeting that went, went really late, so. Uh, I was wondering, which school did you go to when you were like in middle school? Which school? I grew up down in Heartland, Vermont, and I went to uh, Woodstock for junior high, so middle school, and then I went to uh, uh, Woodstock High School uh, down in Woodstock, Vermont. Um, were there bullies at your school? Were there bullies? Well, yeah, I did deal with a few bullies growing up. Um, wasn't too bad. Uh, um, but uh, yeah, I think bullying uh, has been part of being a kid. Um, it's something we've all what experienced about? for too long. So great. This is Josh. Hi, Josh. Hi. Nice to see you. Cool. What uh, What are your questions? What type of edu education do you use to be a man? Great question. Um, well, I did go to college. Uh, I was. I was fortunate to, to go to, to college and then even um, uh, after I'd been out of college for a few years I uh, thought I might want to work in government uh, service in one way I thought maybe I want to run for office someday and so I did actually go back to school and I got something called a master's in public policy so it's a it's a graduate degree in public policy and it's got some economics background in there it's got some statistics in there it's got some history lessons it actually had some local government law uh, elements to it. So it was a lot of stuff that I do find is pretty good background for being mayor. But when I got out of grad school, I was, I guess, about 28, and I ran for mayor when I was 42. So in between, I had some really important work experience that was a big part of my education as well. My name is Haley. Hi, Haley. Good to see you. Thanks for being here. What's on your mind? So, um, I got this question that might be embarrassing. Uh-oh. My goodness. All right. Well, I get asked lots of questions. Well, I, I can probably take it. Go for it. What's your wife's name? What's my wife's name? That's not embarrassing. And I, who do you love? What's my wife's name and who do I love? And also, what's well, your I'm... crush in middle school? Aha! <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh. Now I see <laughs> Let's see. So my wife's name is Stacy, who I do love. So it's fortunately we've been married 15, almost will be 16 years in May, and uh, like I said, we have two daughters, and uh, we have uh, you know I feel very lucky uh, about the people in my family, and both of us have parents who are healthy and we're close with. So um, so that's my family. Um, 
Now, who did I have a crush on in middle school? I've got to think about that for a moment. Um, or high school. There was, a, there, was a, <laughs> there was a movie called, I mean, is this kind of crush? There was a movie called The Karate Kid, which came out when I was in middle school, and I think Elizabeth Shue was in The Karate Kid, and I thought she was pretty great. <laughs> Who do I work with? Great question. Well, right here in the mayor's office, we're sitting in my office and at this conference table, which is where I spend a lot of my day. And then right out here, we have the rest of the mayor's office where we right now have Jordan and Brian and Jen. And we actually, for just a couple months, we have this special opportunity. We have a fourth person working with us out there whose name is Liz. And so they work right here and they're kind of part of the mayor's office team. But then the except one of the great things about being mayor is um, I am responsible for all these other areas of running the city, like the people who take care of the streets and the sidewalks, the Burlington Electric Department is, is a part of the, I work very closely with them, I work with closely with the people who run the airport, I work very closely with uh, the people who run the parks, keep the playgrounds and the parks in, in good shape. Um, uh, uh, we have a library uh, department within the city, so I, I get to work with people who run the library. Um, we have people whose job it is to collect taxes, and I work with them too. We have people whose job it is to write budgets and make sure we spend that money in a sensible way. So all told, there's about 650 people who work um, for the city uh, in one way or another, and so I, I get to work with literally you know hundreds of people in one way or another to help try to make the city run the right way. So, um, why do you like the person for all the karate kid? <laughs> <laughs> I'm still on the subject! I'm never getting out of it. <laughs> um, well, it just, I don't know, what can I say? It just, I thought she, I think I thought she was quite cute at the time. That's what I remember. You need to wrap it up. So Josh, and did you have anything to say? Like maybe just thank you, or any last thoughts or comments? Yes. Okay, go ahead. What is your thoughts on Donald Trump? Oh. What are my thoughts on Donald Trump? Great question. I think uh, he is big trouble for this country. And yes, I, that's uh, what I thought. He's a big meanie. He's yeah. gonna take. Um, he's gonna. You know, he's gonna take um out the um the immigrants, and that's his wife. He's gonna take out his wife. He, yes, what he has said about immigrants and about immigration is terrible. Um, he said a lot of terrible things about a lot of people. And uh, 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 when he came to Burlington in the middle of this campaign, he I think he and his campaign behaved terribly and uh, made it create a real issue for us. Um, I uh, uh, I hope uh, the voters of America see through some of his bluster and. Uh, that they, um, that they'll be, uh, I'm very hopeful we will not have them as our next president. I think that'd be a real, real problem. But I, and I don't we're think it's all going to die. Well, well, I am. I'm so gonna let's, say, let's wrap up and say thank you very much. I have, I have, I have one more question. Yes, oh, thank you. Wait, this is great. Thank you, Josh. Thank, thank you. you. Wait, I have one more question. Though. I have one more question. Though. Okay. I think what? We, okay. But go ahead. You can finish. That was it. Or today. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Mr. Hey, thank you. Or um, your time. All right, it's so great to have you guys come in and even, come back. Uh, come back another time. I hope. Even though you had to pick up your daughter. Yeah, I'm sorry, I gotta rush out and go pick <laughs> up Ada and Leland, but I, I do have to do it. Yeah. Thank, thank you so. for thank watching. You. Thank you. But we're probably gonna wrap that up and go home. And um. Probably we're gonna get some maple creamy.